been working a side control escape uh, on the bottom. This technique is on the GP1, the fundamentals. Very important because we're working on creating space, creating angles in a different way. We're going to do that, that technique now. It will be Professor Dave in the side control, cross face and under hook. Usually, when he's here in this position, I'm defending myself, arms in. If I can, I'm going to start making frames. And then start using this to create space, defend myself, so I can begin to create angles to escape. Right now, he's going to get the same control, but his head's really tight with me and he's very tight here. I have no chance to create frames. He's not allowing me to bring my hand here, okay? So now the, the escape's going to look like this. I'm going to work in the head, the head position. Once I'm here, he's still tight on me. I go to recover guard. I still hug and I don't have much space. Now I'm going to make the frame. And we do a transition to the omoplata. Cool. Sit up and we continue with the base omoplata. And back. You don't have to force the omoplata and finish all the time. Most of you, if not all of you already know how to finish. You just drill in the movement, get in here, you go back, and we reset. Okay? So we do it again. The idea now is this. If I cannot create frames, I want to bring his head on top of my head, okay? Both arms are in. So I'm going to use this arm here to push his head as I bridge. Stay tight of this, hands together. Nice. I'm going to do this. Now the inside hand, I want to try to push his knee. So he cannot go back to the angle. As I hip escape, I'll catch my knee underneath and the other leg. It happens really fast. Now I have space for the frame. Then we're gonna do it at this point. So I'll make the frame. But remember, the situation is still not giving up. He's still trying to hug and stay tight on me. And I have to start forcing. Once I break, the topping is there to not let him wash it up. So I'm pinching, I'm sideways. This leg gonna go over. But now I have to free the bottom leg and go back flat. So I can use this to push his face. So I can free my bottom leg. And I go back flat. Now right away I have to sit up, control his body so he doesn't escape. And kick, kick back, all my weight goes on him. And during this practice, remember, you can put all your weight in your partners, you're not hurting them. Some techniques you put too much weight during the practice, you, you don't do resistance, you can do less. But this in particular, for me to be able to sit up, it's hard to sit up if I'm sitting. I have to put all my weight on him. Once, once my hip gets off the ground, it gets easier to create leverage here, right? So you're gonna lean all the way. So one more time, guys. So ask your partner on top to stay very tight. And I'm gonna do this. One, hand on the knee, push, and catch. Frame, start breaking. Sometimes they let, let it go earlier, even better. Pinch, leg, see the knee. It's always, it's always good to practice uh, homoplata, so you keep getting there, okay? So let's go, guys. Same partners. Two times and switch. Let's go. <laughs>